What it do, Dream Team? It's your boy D Neil and Mackenzie back with another reaction video, guys. Here we are with the weirdest Republican campaign commercials. Have you seen some weird campaign commercials in your time? I'm sure I probably have. <laughs> Dog, <laughs> nah, these should make you laugh. Like, <laughs> some of these commercials, I'll be like, what was they thinking? But before we jump in, make sure you subscribe, ring notification bell, get the video a thumbs up. Let's let you see them and hear what you think. Over in America, they've just had the midterm elections, or as Fox News puts it, the midterms. <laughs> <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> what? I should say it. The midterms. <laughs> so what happened? Now, voters in the United States have been taking part in the crucial midterm elections where members of the U.S. Congress are elected. How did that turn out? Well, a lot better for the Democratic Party than most polls had predicted. The red wave promised by the Republicans did not materialise. No, it didn't. Mainly because most of their candidates were utterly insane. If you hate cops just because of cops, the next time you get in trouble, call a crackhead. Are you <laughs> oh my god. Call a crackhead. <laughs> it's like it was such a serious face, dog. Next time you get in trouble, call a crackhead. <laughs> Why I gotta be a crackhead? <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Why crackhead out of everybody? Yeah, out of everybody. <laughs> That's just so random. Oh my god, bro. Are you racist? <laughs> Ain't even no politician said crackhead, dog. Uh, <laughs> Alright, here we go. The next time you get in trouble, call a crackhead. <laughs> Are you a racist? Do you hate Mexicans? The radicals want a drag queen in every classroom. I'm not doing this for you. <laughs> pronouns? Our patriot and ass kicker. Pro gun, pro wolf, pro life. <laughs> Bro. Oh, we're a wild country, dog. That was weird. We are, we are. That, <laughs> I said, are you racist? Do you hate Mexicans? <laughs> I swear to God. God dang. <laughs> But this is what uh, you're talking about. People like this. I believe in Jesus, guns, and babies. All <laughs> <laughs> I want to know, who the fuck doesn't believe in babies? <laughs> <laughs> Not real! Imaginary! <laughs> Get this dwarf actor out of my face! <laughs> Did you see who Fox News blamed for the Republican performance? Single women and voters under 40 have been captured by Democrats. No poll saw that coming, and it was because these women just went crazy. Because <laughs> these women just went crazy. Yeah, we just went crazy. Because <laughs> they ain't vote the way you wanted them to vote. They went crazy. Yeah. Okay. I'm no expert, but maybe women didn't go crazy. Maybe, and this is just an idea, but maybe women voted against Republicans because they didn't want to live in a country that outlaws abortion. It's just an idea, I'm not sure. <laughs> Mental, man. As with all elections, there was so much disinformation. Did you see this fake video of Joe Biden? Ladies and gentlemen, and now our great national anthem, Baby shark, do 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 do. Baby shark, mommy shark, do 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 do. Mommy shark, do 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 do. Mommy shark, do 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 do. Mommy shark. Bro, what did he really got up there and did that? Bro, I'm vibing with it. I I would have died, bro. I would have said, Nah, I love him, but you can't get sitting that president chair, guy. I'm over here, mommy shark. <laughs> it's, it's so unbelievable as if biden could remember all those lyrics if you want to undermine him you don't need to make fake <laughs> videos just filming climbing stairs oh my god <laughs> <laughs> no. 
But some people genuinely believe that Biden <laughs> sings Baby Shark. In fact, some people don't even think that Joe Biden is Joe Biden. I mean, there's several different people playing Joe Biden at this point. And when, when he fell up the stairs going on the airplane, I myself think that that was Jim Carrey. <laughs> huh? <laughs> you can't help but love people, God dang it. You what? Can't. Bro. <laughs> Do y'all know the difference in Jim Carrey and Joe Biden? <laughs> <laughs> if America ain't gonna do nothing else, we gonna entertain. <laughs> I swear. <laughs> oh. oh my God, that's crazy. Jim Carrey. Jim Carrey is pretending to be the president. <laughs> it's madness. Biden forgets, slurs his words, and falls asleep. Surely he's Johnny Depp. <laughs> that was too much, was it? <laughs> what else do they believe? Nancy Pelosi's Kevin Hart. <laughs> Barack Obama is the wheel's tongue later. <laughs> Next, you're telling me Trump's controlled by a ventriloquist, and this is the moment he put the fist in. <laughs> <laughs> was the U.S. midterm elections. Barack Obama is working up to a disastrous result in America's midterm elections. The Democratic Party lost big. Or as one U.S. pundit put it, the Democrats get their butts kicked. This makes him a lame duck president. Nothing tells the story oh more vividly God. than this. He's left with little to no legislative power. Something of a lame duck. In the blink of an eye, the most powerful man in the world has become history. <sighs> <laughs> Poor Obama. He's in power, but he has no power. Hmm. Who does that remind me of? <laughs> who is that? Oh, I wanna know you know who that was? I don't know who that was. No, is how did Obama lose power to people like this? I'm Joni Ernst. I grew up castrating hogs on an Iowa farm. <laughs> when I get to Washington, I'll know how to cut pork. <laughs> I don't even, I don't even get it. Like, trim the fat, like, get rid of the pigs? No. So what does she mean? I don't know, when, but it ain't that. When I get to Washington, I don't know how to cut pork. I'm trying to, y'all help me in the comments section. Like, what did she mean by that? What was that supposed to mean? Because I'm lost. You can rip off Senate. She doesn't belong in politics. She belongs in a fucking butcher's. <laughs> over here. How sinister would that be? Vote for me. Because when I was little, I chopped off a chihuahua's dick. <laughs> <laughs> oh. It wasn't just her. Fair to say in America, they like their politicians pretty simple. I believe in God. I'm not Barack Obama. We're Republicans. We should be better than that. Bibles and guns brought us here. And Bibles and guns will keep us here. <laughs> They're like psychotic <laughs> Forrest Gumps. <laughs> I ain't never done no thinking. Vote <laughs> for me, America. I can't read and I got me a boom boom stick. <laughs> This candidate for last. Check out this guy. Hi, I'm Bob. I am running. Running for Iowa's open seat in the U.S. Senate. <laughs> Seems like a nice vote. I wonder what else he's got to say. If you are the sexual predator and sociopath who murdered my sister Lynette, and you come to my front door to do harm to my girls, I'm going to use my Glock to blow your balls off. That was like a real commercial? Oh my god. The way he said it with a smile, I'm gonna use my Glock to blow your balls off. <laughs> I mean, 
<laughs> I'm not mad at you for that part, cause yeah, you know what I'm saying. It sounded like his sister got got uh, did he say molested or murdered? Murdered. So I'm not mm-hmm. mad at you about hey, intruders coming through the door, you blowing their balls off. But, but that's yeah. just a weird thing to use as a yeah, as a commercial. Like you could have just said, "I'm gonna take you out." Uh, and I I'll, mean, I mean, like that probably shouldn't have been. Yeah, I do his agree topic. with that. <laughs> I do agree with that for sure. That's just weird. Like, oh, my sister got molested or murdered, whichever he said. Um, yeah, you come for my girls, I'm gonna blow your balls off. Like, I don't think I would expose that. <laughs> that's <laughs> weird. I'm like, okay. I know if I, I was would, watching and, it, I'd be like, yeah, if I saw this commercial, I'd be like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> that don't make me want to vote for you, but... Good luck. Yeah, I'm glad to know that you and yours are protected. Right. <laughs> he is the friendliest psycho ever. <laughs> Imagine what the rest of that advert looks like. If you try and break into my house, I'll rip your skin off and wear it like a dress. (laughs) That's weird. If you put your rubbish in my wheelie bin, I'll kill your dog. (laughs) Over in America, finally, a glimmer of hope. For the first time in 25 years, Alabama, a state in America's deep south, has elected a Democrat senator. Doug Jones is really? the unlikely victor in a deeply Republican state. Republicans were left to pray. Their candidate, Roy Moore, lost in the face of accusations he had sexually assaulted multiple teenage girls. He was accused of abusing a 14-year-old girl. We saw this, was... this clip in a different video, so we're going to skip past and uh, go try to go to the next clip. Let's see. Alabama, there's a lot. Oh, we, we remember that. That, mm-hmm. was, that was wild what he said. I remember her. Okay, let's go. We did this too, didn't we? When he said, uh, you don't actually have to swear in yep. on the Bible. Guys, I think, okay, here we go. I'm sorry we skipped most of the video, but... If you want to check out our reactions to those clips, there's other videos that we reacted to already that have those clips in them. And the pursuit of happiness. Now I'm nowhere. Have taken the <clears throat> ideas about the American dream. Abortion, sodomy, and materialism have taken the place of life, liberty, German and the movies. pursuit of happiness. Now I'm no expert. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm pretty sure that sodomy doesn't lead to abortion. If you're no. having anal sex and it leads to a baby, <coughs> you're doing it wrong. <laughs> I mean, that is a spec savers ad waiting to happen. <laughs> Just... <laughs> Just face it, Roy, you lost. The people of Alabama said no to bigotry, no to idiocy, and the whole world saw it. With our own eyes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, we I saw that one too. Yeah, we did. So uh, this was a good video, though. The parts that we didn't get to see so yeah. far at the beginning. Uh, those commercials were weird. They were really weird. Were like, have people really? Did these commercials really make people go for y'all, dog? Like, right. who was in charge of marketing? Who was in charge of? <laughs> And I think as a politician, you get to see the commercial before you okay it. Because it's like, this message is approved by. Mm-hmm. They saw this and thought, that's a good commercial. Right. <laughs> they, that's just weird. <laughs> <It's>, <laughs> that's how we got y'all. Make sure y'all subscribe, ring notification bell, get a video, a thumbs up. We out.